ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Cameron House Marina. My name's Ruben Mercer, I'm the sales manager here at Marine Sales Scotland. Delighted today to present to you a Finmaster 7600 sports family. So this little cruiser performs like a bow rider, but she also has the practicality of a sports cruiser. There's a Volvo D4D 225 horsepower engine in her, and that gives her a top speed well, well in excess of 40 miles an hour. Of course she does have a full bimini with the full enclosure and um, that is finished in cream white. Let's take a little look on board. So at the stern then the swim platform is covered in teak as is the aft cockpit. These cushions are just pop in pop out. There are also ingrained, uh, sorry, inbuilt fender holders that are more mo molded into the fiberglass. Access is through a stainless steel door. Tables removable to access the engine underneath. Holders are ingrained into the table. So you can access the fore deck via both port and starboard. Big chunky grab rails on either side. Pretty good cockpit space for a 25 footer. Where the magic happens is down in here. Let's have a look. You get a great feeling of space and light in here and the cockpit due to the open plan layout. Now, the very first thing that you may notice is the soft tread teak inlay on the flooring in here. What it is, it's a synthetic composite teak that is actually grippier when wet. Uh, perfect to use it on a lot of bow rider speedboats. Gives it a nice authentic feel in here. I really do like the upholstery. Everything is original, uh, kept in tip-top condition, and then the joinery as well has been French polished, so there is a hell of a lot of gloss, shine and class to the boat. Now, if we pay our attention to the galley area, we have a sink, hot and cold, and also a Wallace electric heater. Now, Finmaster, rather than when the, heat, when the hobs are off, rather than just waste heat energy, when you close this down, it blows warm air out of here, thus heating up the boat. Always a handy thing to have in Britain. And then a fridge. Again, French polished, very nice. Heads compartment, good size, full headroom, and then a sea toilet with a waste tank. So just off to the galley, we have a single berth. Use it for storage, maybe for the kids. You get two kids in there easily. But, the driving position it's fantastic you've got your stereo control there look at these awesome speakers you know they really are everywhere they're out there as well the sound off this is absolutely incredible and from your driving position you have a hummingbird fish finder and the GPS Volvo Penta D4D 225 horsepower, as I mentioned earlier. Electric trim tabs, electric anchor, bow thruster. And she's only done 266 hours. A VHF, not to forget. Very, very nice saloon area. I'd say two on each couch would be realistic. Nice place to have your dinner. However, if you are accommodating more guests, why not get one to sit on that seat there? Up in the forward berth then, plenty of headroom if you're lying down. Real good length. Storage underneath. And I really do like that nighttime seat. 
right next to these speakers, more speakers. The thing about that seat is it's fantastic if there are too many people around the table, if you need somewhere, well, an overflow seat really, because you're still part of the action, you're still part of the entertainment here. Very, very nice. And then this slots into the fastening here. You can remove this, just peels off, and that extends the accommodation, the berth that you have there. Very, very smart from Finmaster. The roof pulls across, a manual pull, windscreen wipers as well to port and starboard. She's a really, really tidy boat. Let's have a look at the engine. So she's powered by a Volvo Penta D4D, 225 horsepower turbo diesel. Gives her performance in excess of 40 miles an hour. She's only ran 226 hours as well and had her last service last year. Fantastic folks, there we have it. Really, really nice Finmaster 7600 Sports Family. Give us a call.